One of the best things about this amenity is that it's it, the, it's free for members to come enjoy. And so we have um, stand-up paddle boards, we have kayaks that you can just reserve on the hour and take out and enjoy the lake. And if you've never paddled one of those boats before, our staff can help get you oriented and show you how to use it. And it's appropriate for anyone. Um, we can serve kids as young as four, as long as they're accompanied with their parents, um, you can spend the day and it's a lot of fun. So we do have a, a number of rules and policies that we expect people to follow. The first is that they have to wear a PFD all the time or a personal flotation device. People call them life jackets. Um, our staff will help people get into them, help them get adjusted properly, um, really give them an orientation to how to use the equipment so that when they're out on the water, they're doing it in as safe a way as humanly possible. We also have a waterfront lifeguard staff that are out there just monitoring what's happening, assisting people with rescues and just out there to make sure that it is as safe as an experience as it can be. And then we also have waterfront staff who are helping you with your equipment, making sure that it's a good fit and making sure that you understand how to use it before you get out on the water. We get a lot of questions around whether people can bring their own equipment, and they can. We have a process for inspecting people's personal equipment. We allow kayaks, we allow canoes, we allow stand-up paddle boards, and our staff will just inspect it to make sure that it meets all of our safety standards in order for them to go out on the water. There's a small private boat fee, um, but that's only a one-time fee, and once you're through the system and we've inspected all your equipment, then you're good to go for the season. We do have a few activities on the lakefront that um, cost a nominal fee. Fishing is one of them, a very small fee to fish in our lake, it's catch and release. Um, there's a small fee to take out the John boats if you wanna fish from the John boats, and there's a small fee for some group exercise classes that are really specialized for lakefront. But other than that, it's free and available to anyone who's a member. People ask us a lot if swimming is gonna be an option on Robinwood Lake. And right now, the short answer is no. Um, dark water swimming is, not something that we take lightly and we want to make sure that people are participating in as safe a way as humanly possible. So right now, all the activities that we're running will require the use of a life jacket to be out on the lake. Our lakefront is open from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Uh, as soon as school lets out, we're open from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. and on Sundays, 1.30 p.m. to 7 p.m. So a little shorter day on Sunday, but for the most part, we're here whenever you want to come out and visit. Even if you don't want to get out on the water, out on the lake, there's still plenty to do on the lakefront. There's a sand volleyball court. You can play sand volleyball. You can just hang out on the beach. There's a patio just outside the pool that you can hang out on. You can have a picnic. There's plenty to do to keep you occupied, and it's really fun. So stop on by and see us.